For data compression, the use of sound perception in critical bands and absolute threshold only is not sufficient for high compression rates. The basis for further data reduction is the masking effects investigated by Svikler. For band-limited noise or a sinusoidal signal, frequency-dependent mask, uh, masking thresholds can be given. These thresholds perform masking of frequency components if these uh, components are below a masking threshold. The application of masking for perceptual coded is described in the following. First, we do the calculation of signal power in band. So the sound pressure level within a critical band is calculated. The absolute threshold is set such that at 4 kHz signal with peak amplitude of plus or minus 1 LSB for a 16-bit representation lies at the lower limit of the absolute threshold curve. Every masking threshold calculated in individual critical bands which lies below the absolute threshold is set to a value equal to the absolute threshold in the corresponding band. Since the absolute threshold within a critical band varies for low and high frequencies, it's necessary to make use of the mean absolute threshold within a band. The offset between signal level and the masking threshold in critical band I is given by this equation here, where alpha denotes the tonality index and alpha V is the masking index. The masking index is given by this equation here. As an approximation, we can use this equation here. If a tone is masking a noise-like signal where alpha is equal to 1, the threshold is set to 14.5 plus I dB below the value of the LSI. If a noise signal is masking a tone, where alpha is equal to zero, then the threshold is set to 5.5 plus I dB below LS. In order to recognize a tonal or a noise-like signal within a certain number of uh, samples, the fact, uh, spectral flatness measure can be estimated. With the sound pressure level LS and the offset O of I, the masking threshold can be given by this equation here. So we have the sound pressure level and this is the distance to the masking threshold.